U.S. postal workers in McAllen are still fighting to keep their jobs. This time, taken to the streets. Action Force Rafael Carranza is live in our studio with more. Amber, more than 100 jobs are on the line affecting service across the Rio Grande Valley. U.S. postal workers here say they are not going down without a fight. For the third time, Valley postal workers held a protest rallying against the potential closure of the McAllen mail processing plant. The protesters, say, the protesters say if the jobs head north to Corpus Christi, the Valley's economy will be gravely impacted. In all, the Valley would lose about 140 jobs in various capacities. U.S. postal workers from McAllen say good paying jobs are hard to come by and they don't want to see these and they don't want to lose these much needed jobs uh, here from the Valley. We want good paying jobs. We want our economy to, 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 to be stable. And by taking these good paying jobs, which are less and less these days, you know, you're hurting the economy. A study by the U.S. Postal Office calls for shutting down offices across the nation. The USPS says it lost more than $5 billion in the past year and expects losses to accelerate this coming year because of emails and other forms of electronic communication. There will be a town hall meeting to discuss this very issue on December 1st. The community is invited to attend. The meeting will take part on the third floor of the McAllen City Hall from 7 to 9 p.m. And, of course, you, uh, we'll have more details posted on that on valleycentral.com. Live in the studio tonight, Rafael Carranza, Action 4 News.